You have to be in love with what you do. This cannot be work. It cannot be hard. It cannot be difficult. When you are in love with what you do, you never have to work a single day. You have to stop working. If you come here because you want to learn to love what you do. So much so there is nothing else you rather do. Then this is the place to learn. Whether you are A.R. Rahman or whether you are Picasso, when you are good at what you do, you have to love what you do. You have to be a little crazy. You have to pour your heart and soul into it. Then the magic happens. Magic doesn't happen in Vicon. Magic is already in you. Vicon only wakes you up. The success must come to you. It must flood you. It must overwhelm you. And still, you are not aware. You became wildly successful and still pursuing what you do. Because the success doesn't matter anymore. You're doing it because you love it. That is significant. Receive. And you don't know how you earned it. You have no idea how you earned it. Are you with me? Because it's a lottery. And because it's a lottery, you don't know how to go back there again. What is critically important always in life is to know how you got there. So you can keep going back there anytime. And that is significantly more important. Amongst all of you here, there's a great majority of you here who came here saying, Wow, there is something magical that's going to happen in Vicon. And some magic is going to change you. Something magical is going to uplift you. And you're going to become instantly successful. Why? Because you came here and warmed a seat for five days. No. I can tell you that right now. No. There's nothing magical in Vicon. The only real magic is in you. It is when you realize that, that Vicon will become the bridge between the person that you are today and the person you should be tomorrow. But if you don't build that bridge, you will remain where you are. In order to build that bridge, you must be hungry. You must be hungry and you must be angry. Out of this entire crowd, every week on, 
1%. Move from there to here. Why? Because they are angry, they are hungry, and they are crazy. What's the difference you think between two people on life's journey? Having the same background, growing up from the same village, going through the same classrooms. There were so many people who sat next to you in class, a few rows away from you in class, coming from the same background. Essentially, there should be no difference between where they are in life today and you. But there is tremendous difference. Many of them have gone out there and surpassed you. Not always the ones with the highest marks, but the ones who are the most daring, the most determined, and the most dedicated.